What to do when someone is having a severe allergic reaction? Step one, inject the epinephrine into their outer upper thigh. Call 911, state anaphylaxis, and tell them that the person may need epinephrine when the emergency responders arrive. Lay the person flat on his or her back with both legs elevated until emergency responders arrive. This position is vital because it promotes blood flow to the heart and to the head, which will help them remain conscious. Avoid any sudden changes in posture and do not allow the person to walk, stand, or sit upright, even if they start to feel better. If the person is struggling to breathe or if they look like they may start to vomit, then gently and slowly help them change positions by lying them on their side for as short a time as possible in recovery position. If the person stops breathing, begin CPR. Step four, closely monitor the person and their breathing. Five minutes after the first injection has been made, if their symptoms are getting worse or if their symptoms are not getting any better, it's time to inject the second epinephrine into the opposite thigh. I say opposite thigh because what happened when you injected the medication into the first thigh is that the blood vessels have constricted. So if you inject the second epinephrine into that same thigh, the medication has nowhere to go to do its life-saving work. So please make sure that if you need to inject the second epinephrine to do it in the opposite outer upper thigh. Step five, store the used epinephrine auto injectors in a rigid container if available. When the emergency responders arrive, they will want to see it to check the dose that was administered to the person. Please note that epinephrine is not a fix to an allergic reaction. It is supposed to stabilize the person in order to give them enough time so that they can be transferred to a hospital where they will be further monitored and provided more medication as needed because symptoms can reoccur. Please share this video with everyone that you know and don't forget to like and subscribe. Thanks.